five, six uh, sort of breaths that I would say. <laughs> All right, uh, so we just finished touring the uh, Hezja Shady geothermal plant, uh, which is just about a half hour uh, outside of Reykjavik. Uh, really cool facility. Uh, this bad boy produces about 300 megawatts of electricity and like 140 uh, thermal uh, megawatts that it sends in the form of hot water uh, to Reykjavik. So a couple, couple notes. Um, I was I was looking for some reference to what creates the heat in uh, in the planet's core because uh, they you know they talked a lot about how they harness the heat, um, the drilling involved, um, how they uh, sequester CO2 as well, um, but no uh, no reference to the the heat source uh, in the planet, which of course uh, you know about. A little less than half is the primordial heat from the very you know beginning of our planet, and uh, uh, the majority uh, is from uh, the decay of radioactive isotopes and fission in our planet's core, nuclear fission. Uh, so uh, that that would have been nice nice to hear to get that in there. Um, however, I think uh, I think nuclear plants have a lot to learn from this uh, this exhibition here. Uh, there was a self-guided tour. You could bring headphones in. Uh, there was a really uh, nifty uh, display where you you turned a kind of a, a like a wheel to like you were opening a pipe or something like that. But it it did uh, it was connected to a projector display and it took you through all the different steps uh, to make geothermal energy. Um, very very cool uh, displays and I. I uh, I wish nuclear plants had visitor centers like this. There's no security. You just you just walk in. Um, of course, behind the exhibition, that <laughs> there is security to go in there. But uh, you know what's stopping nuclear plants from having a, a visitor center that you can just walk into, um, you know, and uh, without uh, doing a background check and scheduling a tour, you know, two to four weeks in advance. Uh, no, no wonder the public doesn't know anything. Uh, about about uh, nuclear, so um, a lot of a lot of fun stuff to learn here. This country is beautiful, and I'm looking forward to seeing more of it. Oh, and one more thing, I uh, so I asked the the guys working at the desk uh, what they thought about nuclear energy, and their response was, "I like it. I think it's I think it's great. I mean, we don't need it in Iceland, but everywhere else, I mean." You know, some places if you have hydro, that's also great. Um, it's good for Norway, but uh, for everywhere else, uh, nu nuclear would be uh, really amazing and um, a big upgrade over uh, uh, what else is what else is being used right now. So that was that was cool to hear that from the guys working here.